my beautiful butterflies welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Beverly and it is lovely to see you today in this video I thought it'd be really nice to organize and sort out my my whole altar space so grab a cup of tea let's do this <music> So I used to record in here quite a lot but I haven't for a while because I have a whole space now for recording which is such a blessing but I've brought you back up because today I need to organise and clean my altar space. So this over here is my altar but underneath is a cupboard where all my like magical tools, spare candles, jars, you know, stuff herbs things like that are all put and to be honest it's a bit of a mess <laughs> so i've bought some of these these are woven rectangular baskets a set of three from b m which is a shop here in the uk these were five pounds so you get two of these smaller ones and one of these bigger ones i bought two of these sets and I thought today we would just take everything off here, take everything out of there, clean it, cleanse it and make it look pretty. So let me show you what we're dealing with at the moment. <laughs> oh my goodness me. But before we start, don't forget, if you are new here, you can click the subscribe button to become part of the Butterfly family. We would love to have you come and join the fun. Don't forget as well to leave me a cheeky like and a comment so I know that you're enjoying this video. But uh let's show you the madness <laughs> so here is the top of my altar and it looks really nice like I have pictures up for my deities this is Diana's section this is Archangel Michael yes I used Henry Carvel for Archangel Michael because uh, why not um, here's his space and then over here is my ancestors i have pictures for my ancestors and this is where i keep my money spell then i've got like some offering bowls this lovely area here is this is a spell as well and then i've got some candlesticks and then it looks really nice up here <laughs> like this looks really pretty and witchy and then you open this and it's just like bam mental chaos and I think a lot of witches have this sort of setup but I want to kind of put my extra jars somewhere else and have them you know stored away somewhere and just get a little bit more organization the other side is a little bit more like I've got all my herbs and things here and oils and stuff then down here I've got my essential oils and some more herbs but I really want to make it more cohesive so uh, let's get to work we're going to take everything off everything out and um, make sure the inside is as nice as the outside and make it all nice and clean
this first box is going to have all my candles in and I do have a lot of candles <laughs> oh my goodness okay so I have a lot of these sort of candles and they fit perfectly in there now and they're for specific times so this is for Yule but I never use them up in time so I save them for next year and then I've got these sort of I buy these sometimes for certain spells because you need certain colours or spells and then at the bottom I've got all my bigger candles I think this is going to be perfect storage witch tip I bought myself a coffee grinder to grind up herbs and things because I do find a pestle and mortar kind of hard to use so I bought myself this all the things that I talk about that um, or show you I'm gonna leave links to down oh boobs <laughs> sorry leave links to down below but isn't that cute Little coffee grinder yay looks just so much better than it did before and I just feel like I can easily find what I'm looking for now and it's surprising what stuff you keep and you think I'm going to use this tiny box and then it never gets used for things so I think it's really important to just really look at what you're going to use and be ruthless if you need to because <laughs> we witches love to collect little boxes and jars <laughs> I have a pile of jars down here that I'm going to organise in the bottom of, I have like a little cart here that you can, you know, on a trolley. And I have like my tarot cards and my to be read books. And I think in the bottom that's going to be where I have jars and things. So just getting organised feels really, really nice. I, uh, I think my top looks really so much better as well and it looks gorgeous lit. I love having it lit at night. If I remember I'll take a video, but if not check my TikTok, link is down below because I do often do like a little video of how it looks when I'm sweeping around thinking oh this looks so pretty tonight <laughs> so I really hope that you enjoyed this I have noticed that you guys enjoy my vloggy type videos a lot so I'm going to be bringing more of that to the channel if you enjoy this sort of content don't forget to leave me a cheeky little like make sure I know that you enjoy this sort of content and while you're down there why not leave me a comment drop me a comment of some things that you think I should get or ideas or what you think of my outer space transformation I think it looks really nice I have a big pile of like cardboard to be sent to recycling now but um I feel so much better it's just so much more organized so I feel good I knew that I would sorry I had to I had to I had to do it so anyway <laughs> Don't forget, if you enjoy my content and you like my face, head down below, click that little subscribe button, ring that little bell, so you always know when I upload. I'm usually here Mondays and Fridays, my health permitting. I always do my very best to be here with you every week, twice a week. 
take care everyone and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful week. I'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you.